Get the worksheet used in this lesson, as well as hundreds of others, at mathcation.com. This video is about solving multi-step inequalities. You can get the worksheet used in this video for free by clicking on the link in the description below. Solving for multi-step inequalities is very similar when solving for multi-step equations. You will combine like terms, you'll solve for the variable, and then if you divide by a negative number, it's going to change the direction of the symbol of your inequality. This first example problem gives us negative 3x minus 5 plus 6x is less than or equal to 46. The first step in this multi-step inequality is to combine like terms. So if you combine negative 3x plus 6x, you get positive 3x. You bring down your minus 5, bring down your less than or equal to symbol, and the 46. The next step is to get x by itself, so we're going to add 5 to this side and to this side. The 5's cancel. We're left with 3x is less than or equal to 51. And then the final step is to divide both sides by 3 so that you get x by itself on this side. So these 3's will cancel. And then 51 divided by 3 is 17. So the solution is x is less than or equal to 17. Let's do a couple practice problems on our multi-step inequalities worksheet. The first problem we're going to do on our multi-step inequalities worksheet is number 1. The problem gives us 1 plus 4x plus 3 is greater than 20. The first thing we need to do is we need to combine like terms. So in this case we're going to add 1 plus 3 because they are the like terms on the left side of the inequality and 1 plus 3 is 4 so we bring down the 4x and then we combine 1 and 3 we bring down our greater than symbol and then 20 then the next step is we have to get x by itself so we're going to subtract 4 from both sides so that this 4 cancels we're left with 4x is greater than 20 minus 4 is 16 the last step is we have to get rid of this 4x. This is like saying 4 times x. So the opposite of that is to divide by 4. These 4's cancel. We're left with x is greater than 16 divided by 4 is 4. So the solution is x is greater than 4. The next problem we're going to do on our multi-step inequalities worksheet is number 6. This problem gives us 10x plus 3 plus 4x is greater than or equal to negative 25. So again, the first step is to combine like terms. So we combine 10x plus 4x, and we get 14x. Bring down the plus 3 and the greater than symbol and the negative 25. Then we have to get x on one side by itself, so we're going to subtract 3 from this side so that the 3's cancel. Whatever you do to one side, you also have to do to the other. So we subtract 3 on this side. We bring down our 14x is greater than or equal to negative 25 minus 3 is negative 28. And then 14 times x, we have to undo. So we divide both sides by 14. The 14's cancel. We're left with just x on this side is greater than or equal to negative 28 divided by 14 is negative 2. So our answer is x is greater than or equal to negative 2. Finally, the last problem on our multi-step inequalities worksheet is going to be number 7. So we have negative x plus 1 minus x is less than or equal to negative 77. So again, the first step is to combine like terms. So we have negative x, and this is like negative 1x, minus another negative 1x. So negative 1 minus 1 is negative 2. So we have negative 2x. Bring down our plus 1, our less than or equal to symbol, and our negative 77. Then we have to get x on one side by itself. So we're going to subtract 1 here so that the 1's cancel. We do minus 1 here. So now we have negative 2x is less than or equal to negative 77 minus 1 is negative 78. Then we have to undo this negative 2x. This is like negative 2 times x. So we divide by negative 2 so that the negatives and the 2's cancel. Whatever you do to one side, you do to the other. So you divide this side by negative 2 as well. 
So we have x on this side. Now we divided by a negative number. And because we divided by a negative, it's going to change our symbol from less than or equal to to greater than or equal to. So now we have x is greater than or equal to. And then negative 78 divided by negative 2 is positive 39. So the solution is x is greater than or equal to 39. If you found this video helpful, make sure you drop a like. Subscribe to our channel or check out our website for more premium math content. Thanks for watching.